Last month I had the opportunity to visit one of the best flea markets in the country. I arrived at 8am to get a peek at the treasure that was behind the pink ribbon before the flood of customers came rushing into the vintage marketplace in Rainbow, California. I'm Rita Reed, co-host of the Vintage Marketplace. And I'm Christy Rupassi. As the vendors were putting last minute touches on their displays, the customers were lining up. Some arrived hours before to be the first in line. You will see items sell very quickly at this event. The line starts so early now, and we come from about an hour away. We're usually about 50 or 60 in line. <laughs> we drove eight hours we're from Northern California. We were here at 645. We try to be the first in line always. <laughs> I buy it. I don't hesitate because someone else is going to get it, I won't be there. We're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> what motivates us to be first to mind is that we just don't like to wait back there because it takes too long to get it. There's a lot of fans. As I spoke with the people in line, I discovered that this was a very special place. Some told me that this was not just a place to shop, but a tradition of meeting old friends and making new ones. It brings a lot of joy to people in hard times. It does. It sure does. And they're all here. Today is about 90 degrees. And they're all here. I do about two to three shows a month. The Vintage Marketplace stands out. Just the amount of effort, I think, that goes into the displays. There's, there's so much work and thought. The displays were amazing. Each booth was beautifully designed and filled with handmade wares and hard to find vintage treasures. Whether you're an artist or a collector, you'll discover many items too good to pass up. I've been here every show for the last three years. I keep coming back here because I love the customer base here. They're friendly and interested and creative. I have a lot of photographers that buy film cameras from me. All of my cameras are refurbished and cleaned and uh, film ready. Um, I'm Kaylee and this is my mom, Ada. Oh, the Vintage Market's the best. Like, this is our ritual, our tradition that we come to the Vintage Market every time they have every three months. So it's like our mother daughter. And we started about five years ago. We uh, took on the idea because of the economy. We grew so fast that we had to find another location. And finally we found Rainbow, uh, the park. Our first show was in March 2009. Okay. 10, I think. <laughs> I'm not sure. It's been five years now. by far the best show in California and we have huge turnout. I just love being a participant in the vintage marketplace because of all the fabulous customers that come here and enjoy the treasures that we bring. These girls came from Iowa and they kind of have a secret between the two of them. Their secret is they they know what price will come down to. <laughs> I try to stay in our space and not go next door, but I'm like, Mom, look at that shade over there. Look at this oh, over I'm here. Do a dance. We're all for a dance. <laughs> oh, we gotta get in a booth. We make them out of cable schools. Yeah. First, first show. First show ever? First show ever. Yeah. So my third time. And I won't come back again. <laughs> I will come back again. <laughs> It'll be, always be a show that I do, but such a great community of people. It's just
I love the creativity and the girls, all the vendors, they just bring it and they're passionate about it. It's like a big family. There's a bonding that happens with the vendors to customers. City. Next event takes place on December 4th, 5th, and 6th. Be sure and check the links below for more information and visit the Vintage Market Facebook page. I'm going to have my sister-in-law with me in this huge adventure. I would say that was a surprise. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that, yes. And I fell into something here together. Yeah, and the family's involved. Uh, it's involved, the kids. So it's a Good family business. Yes. We're happy. Very organic.